YouTube Ed here. So uh, today we're going to try and turn a little dish. Uh, this is a, it's about a three and a half, three and three quarter inch in diameter dish uh, that I turned yesterday when I went over to my father-in-law's house to uh, help him set up his new wood lathe. Uh, he's a, he's a, a really good woodworker in his own right and he does a lot of flat work and stuff and he's decided he wants to uh, get into the turning aspect of woodworking. So I went over to help him set up and I told him a little bit I know about it because I'm pretty new but uh, I got a piece of uh, basswood. This is local wood. This came from a, from a lot not far from my home here and uh, from a friend's lake place. They uh, felled several trees and in an effort to clear out some area and there's uh, actually there's not there's a mill not far away that you can take all this lumber or all these raw trees to and they'll, and they'll turn it into lumber for you. Uh, which is far better use of the wood than just throwing it away, in, in my opinion. Well, at any rate, so uh, he had some lumber made. This is, like I said, this is basswood. He also had some made out of poplar and some other kind of trees. But I got a 4x4 four four block here, uh, which is 2 inches thick. I don't know if the grains are in the right direction to be a bowl or a dish, but we're going to we're gonna cut it. And it made a dish yesterday, so I don't see why it wouldn't work again today. I also have a 6x6 six six piece of wood which we may end up going to. Uh, this, this is a real clear piece of wood. It's got, uh, other than this little edge right here, it's got no imperfections in it. Uh, this 4x4 this four four chunk here has got a knot in it that goes clean through and it's either going to work out or it's not. It's going to come winging out of the bowl or it's going to stay there. But I like knots and I like the character that they give the piece so I'm going to try and leave it in there and turn it. So what we're going to do is, uh, I don't know, it's too thin to use a bowl screw uh, and it's too thin to screw screws into for a face plate and still get any depth out of the dish so I'm going to use what I what I presume is a relatively unorthodox uh, way of mounting this up I'm going to use the spindle quills and clamp it together and turn it at a real low speed try and get it to some semblance of round uh, turn a tenon on one side so I can chuck it up in my four jaw chuck and then and then turn the bolt. So I, that's what I did with this one yesterday, and it worked out really good. Uh, like I said, it might be a little unorthodox, but it's it's what I have, and I don't I don't if I use the bowl bowl screw, it's going to go almost completely through. And if I use uh, regular uh, wood screws to screw on a small face plate, uh, they're going to have to go at least halfway through the wood, and I'm going to lose a lot of material to make my dish. So I'm going to try the I'm going to try the spindle quills and see see how we go uh, see how that goes. But anyway, uh, let's do, let's quit talking. Let's get this chucked up in the lathe and uh, and see about uh, turning a bowl or a dish. All right, so we've got this thing uh, we got this thing chucked in between centers or or stuck in the, between the centers, and I got a, a pretty good fair amount of pressure on these. Keep it in here. Uh, it's it's a little out of balance. So I got I got a little I got a little vibration here. If I take my you can see it shaking the phone down. I'm trying this with my iPhone to see how it works out. This might not work out so good. But uh, you can see it's got a little vibration issue. So what we're going to do is we're going to try and we're going to try this camera angle just for the roughing portion of it, and uh, then once I get it roughed around and and get it smoothed out then I'll change the camera angle and we'll uh, we'll make a bowl out of this thing so we'll uh, we'll do a little fast forward action here and a uh, little time lapse and we'll, we'll get this thing turned around and we'll get a we'll get a tenon put on it
there it is. Uh, one dish suitable for whatever you find necessary to be suitable for. Don't, uh, don't exactly know what I'll do with it, but uh, I made it, and that's, and I'm happy with it, and that's really all that matters. That's the, that's the whole point of this whole thing, is to, is to do something that, do something that you did, and the knot stayed in, which I am terribly pleased about. I'm very excited about that because I think that adds a whole lot to it. I'll put a few more coats of oil on it, but that gives you the initial coat so you can see what it looks like. And it just, it really, it really makes the whole thing kind of, kind of unique. So I'm, I'm very, very pleased that the knot stayed in. Anyway, I hope you found this video enjoyable. Uh, I sure had fun making it. It's actually only the second bowl I've ever made or dish. And you know, it's only... It's only about four inches across in diameter, but it was still a whole lot of fun to make. So, at any rate, uh, enjoy, and uh, please subscribe to my channel. Click like if you like, click don't like if you don't like it, but let me know how I can do, what I can do to change it. All right, thanks, and have a great day.